The Roman Catholic Archbishop of Washington has asked parishioners not to lose confidence in the church despite a damning report that implicates hundreds of priests in child sex abuse. It's found around 300 priests in Pennsylvania molested more than 1,000 children, possibly many more since the 1940s. The report accuses senior church officials, including the Archbishop himself, of systematically covering up complaints. Cardinal Donald Whirl had only words of support for child sex abuse victims as he took mass in Washington. The pain and the suffering is something that we need to accept responsibility for in helping survivors. But he failed to mention his own role in concealing abuse. He's accused of protecting priests who'd molested children instead of removing them or reporting them to police. Our contrition and our resolve do not diminish in any way the pain of survivors. The scale of abuse by priests in Pennsylvania has rocked the church across the US. A two-year investigation by a grand jury has found more than 1,000 children were abused by 300 priests going back to the 1940s. Priests were rape raping little boys and girls. They hid it all for decades. Victims want the Pope to intervene. The Catholic Church has two sides of its mouth that it's talking out of right now, and we need to close it off and just get one sound, cohesive answer from the Vatican. The lengthy report was based on victim interviews as well as documents from secret church archives, including handwritten confessions by priests. But some of them have died, and a statute of limitations means only two could still face prosecution. They have to be accountable, the church, for what they did. Some dioceses have apologised to victims, but survivors want nothing less than financial penalties or criminal charges. Jonathan Flynn, ABC News.